Alright, what is going on guys? Joshua Meyer, today we're going back in the jungle with a brand new video, a brand new different type of video. Today we're going to horse come, I think they're called, I don't actually know, sure, but today we're going to be talking about um, the college year. And it has, as the title is, it will be a long way on about it, and it should say something like why, what I feel, really feel about the way it called war, um, something like why I'm not a fan of it. And by this gameplay, it's going to think I love the game, but Honest. Honest opinion, right now, I am not a fan of this game. Like, the game has just got to that point where I've been playing Call of Duty since Black Ops 3, and obviously I've seen it progress in different secure. ways from time zones to really back in the the war, like, even before this uh, time, there's been w uh, World War 2, that's before Gold War. And the game at that point was dying. And honestly, this game has. In my opinion, killing the game, Call of Duty. Obviously, the game has been dying for a while now. Like, in my opinion, because the game has just gone from being one of the biggest franchises ever to going. Everyone went to Fortnite, and then everyone went to Warzone, and that was what lifted this game back up. In my opinion, now we've got no Warzone from the start, which makes me think this game could actually just die. And this game, and we've been trying to say this for a while, man. We've been saying this for a while. People, we. I've been trying to get skill based matchmaking out of this game for so many years. It's really unreal how long we've been trying to get it out of the game. And I think Call of Duty is now turning to not cultivate the content creators and people who actually want to play the streamers and content creators and pro players. It's more like they want to play it, they want it to be for people who don't ever play the game and people who just play the game like once a week and not caring about the people who play it every day, all day. And and another reason for this game dying is less thing right? when Black Ops 3 was out, that was when like, the final camo and stuff come out. That that took a grand. That I didn't get that. I didn't really want to go for it because I knew the ground would have been huge. But the game has it took months. At least I think it took only like three months for the first person to get it. This game, it's not been out a week and keep on the verge of getting it. The max level, I was against a level 8, well, no, it, was, it was on my team this morning, it was before, it was a level 80. It's like, that is nearly Prestige 2, nearly 3 in this game, I think, and you should not be level Prestige 3 in 4 days. It's just not right, and in my opinion, that is killing the game and how quick people are finishing stuff. It's meant to be a grind, you know, it's meant to be a grind, and obviously, we, in the past we've had people who've grinded it so quick and just got it, but it just seems like people are getting it so much quicker than usual, and it just shows how much sweatiest lobbies are getting, and that's a real problem, it's going to sweatiest and skill-based matchmaking is the reason for that, and like I said before, it's not really for people who... That, that right there, I was literally going around the corner, guys were from the corner, it was like... Why, why is there on the floor? Like, you, it used to be. People, I know people complain about a lot about boost jumping games, but that is the only way we get running around games. Like, uh, this lobby is actually not that bad. This lobby is not that bad, but in every other lobby, like, people just want to lie during, they just want to throw them in, and obviously, it's the first lobby game I got thrown in the head, like. But, in this game, it's all it is just throwing grenades, flashbangs instantly, and like, why is this game just turned into tacticals and lethals? Like the game used to be just run around, get as many kills as possible, and then it's just have a sit in a corner. Obviously, we had the campers every now and again, but the camping has just got worse as we progress. And it's because the companies who are making these are supporting it. They're not making things like sounds as well. Sounds in this game are horrible. Like, you can hear this. I think this is a click actually, the right time. Or, me, yeah, this guy, he's literally, he can hear me coming around the corner from miles away. So, how can they know I'm there so quick? And when I watch a kill, I got my sound, I keep my voice off for a second while I listen to it. And it's just, people can hear you so far away and it doesn't help anybody. So if you just sign a corner, you're, you're so protected. I don't know how he doesn't kill me out there. Like, you sit in a corner, don't make a noise. You can hear a guy from three, protect a, a minute away and you, it's going to annoy you. Look, he's shooting and we're not in a corner. It's, this is what Call of Duty is turning to me. It's not turning into playing like an aggressive game mode. It has kind of turned into just camping and support the bad players and average players. The people who like we play every day, all day. It's, it's having to get camos instantly. 
Oh, they just don't play all day and get camos. They just play to get max level. And, and I would say it's going to happen. We're going to get people who come to max level and max ammo in the first week. Obviously, that is a part of the game. But it, 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 skill based matchmaking just doesn't support it. <laughs> like, it's just how we're getting to. We're getting. We're not even in a week. People are nearly max level already. I'm sure the max you can do is a thousand. I think you have to have a few prestiges and you can get to max a level of thousand this year. And I will not be surprised, honestly, if you need to be if somebody's max level in under a week when the new season comes out. I think it comes out in like six days next week, I think. And I honestly believe, in my opinion, people will be a level thousand in not even a week. Alright, I'm not, I'm not even being joking there, I'm being 100% serious, I think some of them are still in a week. And it, it, just it just takes a fun out of the game, of grinding, and I don't think it's them making it easier for people to get to that max level. I mean, or, or it just, or it's just, we're, level, we're that good at this point, like, we're just getting to max level a lot but I am level 50, nearly alright. And the game's been at four days, and I honestly I'm not even playing at 100%. I've been playing at least 50% of my time. Anyway, I don't think you're even that. Like, I come on, I load in a game. I think a few times when I've just gone on the game, got a kill, or died, and just like you know, I've done something to play, and just load on PC because the people on PC, obviously the people I go on PC with, and people who play COD, they on the other And I've actually been enjoying Among Us so much recently, and it's just been taking me away from this game. It's like. A PC game is taking away from one of my favourite franchises of all time. Like, I don't know how the Call of Duty is going to solve this. Nuke Champions are like next week as well, and I'm like, really thinking, like, is this really what Call of Duty is going to be about? Like, how just. Oh, sorry about that. Nuke Champions, I don't even want to think about it, man. Like, it's got that fair now, Call of Duty. It's just, and I can't even say I'm sweating as well. I'm talking to you. Every other game I go in, like, people are flying through the sky. The You can shoot one bullet into somebody and then turn around and, sit and just lazy. you. Like, people are complaining about Fauna. Like, how can you complain about Fauna? That was the game adapted. That was. The, we know, and obviously, I get the point of people saying, oh, it's just a game adapted. And it's, this game is going too far. <laughs> Like, I shot, I, I went in the corner, and that guy got me a minimum head. He shot me that many times in such little time. I was like, what to... Nothing with teammates. Teammates in this game, in my opinion, are the worst of them. They are the worst they've ever been. I've been playing a lot of hard point, I think, since we've been playing that. They are the worst teammates I've ever Not these people in game, but the teammates are the worst they've ever been. Like, I was playing Domination with a game for the first time I was doing it on screen, I struggled for a few hours. I was planning on playing six hours. I played three hours because I was quite a long time. That day, if you was on stream at that point, you know I played well. I was playing really well, I was smashing lobbies. I woke up the next morning, and I don't think I played an hour. Seriously, I don't think I played an hour. Like, it was just, just I, it was weird how the game went from lobbies were meh, so Probably, because like, I'm being generally serious here as well. The lobby feels like you're playing a pro match every day, man. I've said this to people. I've said it feels like you're playing a pro game every game. It's that sweaty, and it's like, how do, how have we come from this? And the final thing I'm going to touch on is zombies. I w didn't play zombies for this day too. I was like, I'm bashing. I'm going to smash multiplayer, and I played zombies. <laughs> And somebody told me if you've been playing it, they said it's one of the best in there. I said it looked horrible flying on a syndicate was streaming it every hour there and I was like, oh, watch it for me. And it looked horrible. He was running around with UAVs, uh, strikes, I was like, what? And when I jumped on this, I have never <laughs> been so disappointed in zombies in all my life. You spawn in with your own weapon. You spawn with your own weapon. Like what? <laughs> Why would you? And all bad play. I'm not saying this to offend anyone, but all the bad plays are saying, "Oh, it's good." It's not. <laughs> all the bad plays are enjoying this game because it supports people. Like that. All right. 
right? It, just, it, it supports the bad players, like, saves, weapons, like, every gun he's got. There's not one bad gun this year, I think. Every gun is good, the saves help everybody, the camping's better, the skill-based matchmaking is better, the zombies, it just... I play the zombies, They're, they literally tell you everything. They tell you where everything is, they tell you how to do the spread, they give you your own weapons, they give you streaks, he, he, the weapons, the mobs are the worst thing ever. Look, I must put three matches in the mob and it just split in there too. I was like, what? <laughs> yeah, that's my opinion on the card. I don't. I'm gonna probably make another video in like two weeks, maybe a month. Talk about the call you they call it called it again. In my opinion, change or anything. But yeah, if you enjoyed, make sure to like, subscribe, pull some videos down the cell, and peace, guys.